Well, we can wait here all day if we have to, but someone is going to tell us what's been going on here. Him, I'd expect the silent treatment from. But you, you practically lived at ours over the summer. I would have thought you owed me a little bit more respect. Well, that's why I'm not saying anything. If you want to know what happened, ask Josh. Finn. Josh? I haven't done anything. He's totally lost it. He just attacked me out of nowhere. You're the one who's lost it. Pretending to be my best mate, then trying to put your tongue down my throat. You liar. You your son tried to kiss me this morning, that's what. He's lying, Dad. I don't know what he's on about. Why can't you just tell him, Josh? And you just tell him what a little gay you are. Hey, Finn. that's enough. You can't talk. You're the one who's sucking up to Connor. Hey, hey, enough. Hey, sit down. Whatever's gone on, there's no excuse for that kind of behaviour. You heard what Mrs Fisher said this morning. Zero tolerance. Now, whatever Josh has done to upset you, you do not lie. Why would I lie about him trying to kiss me? Why would I do that? There's no excuse for you attacking him like you did. You can have a detention at lunch and one after school for your troubles. See if you're so keen to pick fights then. And you just be thankful that it was us that caught you and not Mrs Fisher. Because anything like this happens again, Finn, and you will be excluded. Do you understand me? Now, go on. Just wait there one second, Josh, please. What's all this nonsense about you kissing him? I don't know what he's on about. Seriously, Dad, he's been acting jealous ever since he got with Lauren. I think he probably fancies her as well. Probably trying to split us up. All right, well, you keep your distance from him. I've had enough problems trying to keep you out of trouble today. I don't have to do it again. Hey, now, go on. Stay away from me. Have you got that? Oh, Finn! Stay away from me, you freak! <laughs> <laughs>